Hi, good evening. Hi, good evening. Hello. Hi, How are you? Fine. Good Thank evening. You. And to see you in you. Hi, everybody. Fine. Hi. Good evening, everyone. Welcome. Are we ready? Yes. Yes. Yes, All teacher. right, nice, great. Okay, say hello, say good evening on the chat. Wish your partners a wonderful day, a wonderful class. Uh -huh. Let's see. Good evening, good evening. Everybody writing a nice message, please. And today is Wednesday. Wednesday. Hello. Wednesday, 23. Yes, 23rd. March. Yes, March 23rd. That's right. Well, this is our class number. <laughs> Seven. Good evening. <laughs> okay. This is our class number seven, that's nice. And we're gonna have the attendance because, yes, here we have the chat, here we have hello, good evening, good evening, welcome. I hope you're fine, I hope you're having a good time. And that's awesome. Okay. And then Raquel Zero, right? Brian, Giovanni, either. Brian Stanley. Present. Hi. Good evening. Carlos Alfonso. Not tonight. Damaris. Damaris, not tonight. David Alonso. Hello. Eduardo Elias. Present teacher. Hi. Edwin Ernesto, Mr. Chef, not yet. Stephanie Cuella, present. Hi, Fatima Esmeralda, present teacher. Hello, Fatima Lourdes, hello, no yet. Fernando Arturo. Hello, Fernando. Ouch. Somewhere. Not connection. Ahorita llegué. Ahorita llegué. <laughs> I'm coming. <laughs> <laughs> okay, hello. Isabo. Hey. Good evening. Good evening. How are you today? I'm fine. Great. How about you? Well, teacher, yes, teacher, Edwin. Edwin. Hey, don't worry, Mr. Edwin. It's okay. <laughs> All right, no worries. Isabo? Did we get Isabo Present, tonight? Teacher. Hi. Jocelyn, Gabriela? Present, teacher. Hello. Jeremias? Good evening, teacher. Present. Good evening. Jessica, Janet? Present teacher. Hello. Karen, Michelle. Not yet. But Karen is coming late today. Lourdes. Anaí. Not yet. Marcos. Present teacher. Hi. Good evening. Nuria, Karina. Present teacher. Hello. Pablo Josué. Present teacher. Okay, here. And Roxana Beatriz. Present teacher. All right. Teresa is not going to be able to. So she got something. My God, just get some color right here. Because she says she won't be able to be here in class today. Veronica. No, here tonight. 
Victor? Present teacher. Hello, Jessica Marilu? I'm here, teacher. All right, good. Lourdes, Anaí. Tell me. Ya logró entrar. <laughs> and yes. Say something, Lourdes. Okay. <laughs> she didn't want to say anything. All right. Happy Wednesday, everyone. Nice. All right. Say hello. Say good evening. That's awesome. Okay. Well, let's get started. Let's get started by. Give me one second. Yes, one second. Uh huh. What do you remember from yesterday class? Mm -hmm. Any idea? Profes professions. Uh huh. We name yes. profession, jobs, occupations. We ask questions about the class. Uh, yeah, people's in the people in the class jobs, right? What do you do? What does he do? What does she do? What's her occupation? What's his occupation, right? Okay, all right. So let me just um, share the screen for us to be able to review. See, here we go. Uh -huh. Yesterday there was a description and now it's just the picture. She is a nurse. Nurse. Yes, nurse. nurse. Okay. How do you spell nurse? Is this correct? N U R S E. Yes. Yeah. Correct. Yeah. All right. That's correct. Uh huh. Doctor. He's a doctor. doctor. He's doctor. a doctor. doctor. That's right. He's a doctor. Yes. She's a singer. No. Mm. <laughs> From this option? Musician. A musician? No. Mm. <laughs> journalist. A journalist. journalist. She's yeah. a journalist. Yes. Mm -hmm. She's a mechanic. mechanic. Hi. He is a mechanic, that's right. Okay. He's a police officer. He's a police officer. In Instagram, te la estoy mandando. He's a hairdresser. Yeah, she is a hairdresser, that's right. Mm -hmm. Mama, he's a fireman. fireman. Okay, he's a fireman. He's a musician. He is a musician. 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 Yes. She is a teacher. Teacher. <laughs> Uh -huh. He is a chef. Uh -huh. He is a chef. That's right. Correct. Okay. Good score. All right. Okay, this was just a review of yesterday's class. But of course, let me just check. Okay, we're going to continue because yesterday I remember we talked about the possible questions right that you can ask to know about somebody else's occupation so this is what we're going to continue practicing asking and answering questions okay about people occupations right so this is for class number seven as well the reminders remember try to have your cameras on try to have your name your complete full name on the on the zoom Profile, try to have, uh, yes, your mute or silence button if you're not participating in the class. And of course, try to participate as much as possible and use the chat. All right, at the end of this class, of course, you're going to be able to ask and answer questions about jobs and express your opinions about jobs. Okay, so this is what we're going to do. Okay, 
We remember this question about yesterday. What happened? Rachel's brother was in a hotel. In a hotel. hotel. And Angela's brother was in a hotel too. Yes. What does Rachel's brother do? Mm -hmm. He's uh, from this agent. He's a friend desk agent. Okay. Does Rachel's brother, my brother, yes, he say my brother works in a hotel. He's a friend desk agent. What about Angela's brother? He's a manager. He's, a manager. He's the manager, right? In the same hotel. Okay. Uh, that is a coincidence, right? Of course, now we're going to learn how to ask and answer questions related to jobs. Let me just move this right here. Where, where do you work? The place, right? Where do you work? In an office, in a hospital, in a construction site, in a company, in a factory, in a store, the place, where, where do you work? Yes? Okay, the next question is, I'm sorry, hold on. Oh, my presentation is kind of weird. Here we go, sorry. Okay, what do you do? The activity or the occupation or the profession, what do you do? Yes, I'm a doctor, I'm a nurse, I'm a lawyer, I'm a technician, I'm a mechanic, I'm a waiter, I'm a waitress. The activity itself, right? The occupation. How do you like it? It's what's your opinion? How do you like it? Oh, it's interesting, it's nice, it's great, it's awesome. One second, I just need the charger. Uh-huh. It's great, it's awesome, it's exciting. Yes? ¿Qué es? Vendría siendo como, ¿cómo es el trabajo? ¿Qué opinas del trabajo? Right? So it's great, it's awesome, it's cool, it's nice, it's fun, it's interesting, it's boring, it's tiring, it's busy. So, ¿cómo es el trabajo? ¿Cómo lo califica? ¿Cómo ¿Cómo piensa que es el trabajo? Right? Eso es en caso de que le estén preguntando a usted directamente. Yes? Where do you work? What do you do? How do you like it? Yes? Luego, si estamos hablando de una tercera persona, de él o de ella. Where does he work? He works in a hotel. What does he do? He is a manager. How does he like it? Lo que va a cambiar acá es el auxiliary, right? For he, she, we use does. And of course, en caso de que estuviéramos hablando más de más de una persona, que serían ellos, ¿verdad? Sería, where do they work? Uh -huh. What do they do? And how do they like it? All oh, right, give me one second. Okay, here. Okay. So, Richard, yes. Yo tengo una duda. Tell me. Que, ¿Por qué ahora en estas oraciones ya no se utiliza el is y el are? Perfect, sé that's a good se question. Se sustituye por el das, sí, pero vaya. quisiera en saber este... cuándo. Sí, no, en este caso, este, vaya, ¿qué es lo que vamos a, a tomar en cuenta? Porque ya no vamos a usar el is. Porque en este caso ya estamos hablando de una acción que es trabajar, ya no es ser o estar. El is, el are, se usa cuando estamos hablando de que yo soy, él es, o él está, o ellos son. Pero en este caso estamos hablando de dónde trabaja, ¿sí? ¿Qué hace? O ¿qué piensa del trabajo? ¿Qué le parece el trabajo? Si ya son acciones, ya son verbos de acción, ya no son eh, verbos, ya no son el... Ser o el estar, un verbo stated, un verbo de estado, como el ser o el, o el estar, que sería el, la conjugación del am, is, are. Esa es el, la razón por la que se necesita un auxiliary, que en este caso sería do or does. Do para I, you, we, they, he, does para he, she, it. Yes? Sí, gracias. No problem. Bye. En this case, lo que tenemos que mantener en perspectiva es esto, ¿verdad? Si me están hablando directamente a mí, me van a decir, where do you work? What do you do? 
how do you like it? O si yo le pregunto directamente a la otra persona. Yes, where do you work? I work in a hospital. What do you do? I'm a doctor. How do you like it? I really like it. I love it. I enjoy it. Hay tantas expresiones como para, para dar una opinión de qué nos parece un trabajo. Yes? I love it. I enjoy it. It's interesting. It's great. It's awesome. Esto sería como la expresión, si se fijan, en grado de que le gusta mucho, más o menos, y no le gusta. ¿Ya? Porque... I really like it. Es que le encanta el trabajo. El otro, it's okay. Hmm. No está tan mal. It's okay. Y el otro, they hate it. Yes. Where do they work? In a restaurant. What do they do? They are waiters. Or they are waiters. Yes. Or waiters, si fueran chicas, ¿verdad? How do they like it? They hate it. ¿Sí? Vaya, por el caso, si yo estuviera hablando, en este caso, de este chico, el que ven abajo en la foto, de Ben, ¿cuál sería la primera question? Where does he work? Where does he work? Where does he work? Porque estoy hablando de él, ¿verdad? Entonces, la respuesta sería... In a restaurant. Te quiero dar una respuesta corta. In a restaurant. O perfectamente diría he works he in a works. restaurant. Dar una respuesta un poco más larga. No porque en la primera esté incorrecta, sino porque para dar más detalles. ¿ya? He works in a restaurant. Y para practicar lo de la tercera persona, ¿verdad? Ponerle ese al verbo. He works in a restaurant. ¿Cuál sería la siguiente question? What does he do? What does he do? In the answer, he is a wait waiter. He is a waiter. Y, ajá, y por mm -hmm. lo que ustedes ven, por lo que pueden deducir de su expresión, ¿cuál sería la siguiente question? How does he like it? Y la respuesta sería... Hey. No. He, he hates it. He, hate it. He, hate it. he hates it. Or he doesn't like it. He's not happy. It's terrible, it's tiring. O sea, las condiciones de trabajo son difíciles, complicadas. Está, it's no stressful. está feliz. It's, it's, yeah, it's stressful. Entonces, based on this, o sea, basándonos con los ejemplos para guiarnos, obviously, vamos a completar estos ejercicios que serían one, two, three, four short conversations, muy parecidas. Y luego, si nos sobra un poquito de tiempo, pues vamos a hacer questions and answers acerca de las fotitos que están abajo. Questions, ¿estamos claros qué es lo que vamos a hacer? ¿O hay algo que podamos aclarar antes de irnos a los breakout rooms? Igual, yo voy a compartir la imagen para que ustedes la tengan de referencia. Uh -huh. ¿No questions? ¿No? ¿Algo que quieran decir? ¿Algún comment? ¿Alguna recomendación para la hora de trabajar en grupo? Don't be shy, no tengan pena. O sea, ustedes pueden hacer maravillas. Ustedes son artesanos de su propio aprendizaje. Uh -huh. My suggestion es que no les dé pena que practiquen, que les pregunten a sus compañeros con los que queden en el grupo si algo no lo entienden. Yo he visto muy buena, muy buena colaboración de parte de, de varios que les ayudan a los demás en los grupos, les explican nuevamente si todavía les ha quedado duda o les dan un ejemplo o les ayudan a construir sus propias oraciones y eso es muy bueno. Porque debe haber, debe haber teamwork, debe haber trabajo en equipo para poder definitivamente construir el aprendizaje. ¿Sí? ¿Sí? So we're gonna create the teams. Vamos a ver cuántos estamos. So we're gonna create six groups. Van a quedar más o menos de three. Yes. Here we go.
Like how does in the second verse? Like um okay. What does the brother do? What what does what does your brother do? What does your brother do? Mm -hmm. Y porque okay. lleva el, el do al final. Porque me está preguntando qué es lo que hace él. Porque lo que él hace es auxiliar, tratar, el do es como el hacer de él, el diario. Uh -huh. Ajá, sí, sí. Entonces, en la B dice, my sister, she's a nurse. Where does mm -hmm. she? Y ahí, ¿qué sería? Where. Donde ella. Hmm. Ah, no, sería. How mm. like. It's, bueno, por la respuesta que es. It's difficult, but she loves it. Creo que es. Sí. How, do, how do you like? like? Es difícil, pero a ella le gusta. A ella le. Uh -huh. She's love it. Um... Yes. Hello. Hello, teacher. Did you practice? Eh, que otra compañera tiene problemas. Really? Lourdes. Are you okay, Lourdes? No le funciona el micrófono, Lourdes. Ok. Puede tratar de hacerlo usted, Eduardo, y si tiene questions, pues que le escriba la orden en el chat, because she's writing on the chat. Oh. Uh -huh, no problems. Porque dice al fin, después, he doesn't really like it, que no, que en realidad no mucho le no gusta. No le gusta mucho, mm -hmm. no le gusta. He doesn't really. En real, real, ¿cómo creo que se really? Real, eh, realmente mm, no, le, no le gusta No le gusta, mucho. no le gusta. Mm -hmm. Ahora la otra. Oh, I guess they like them. Ahí cuál sería. Where? ¿Qué es? ¿Qué es? Where? ¿Qué es? 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 ¿Qué What do you plan? No, tiene que ser where. No, 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 no tiene que ser where. No, no, where. No, no, porque va, mira, es que aquí dice where does he work. Aquí es como él va. Y aquí es para ellos, where do you work. Y aquí estamos hablando de ti, como de... Ahí sería ellos. Ahí sería como no. decir they. Uh -huh. No, no, yo creo que where do you parent? Mm. No sé si sería where, sería como preguntar a dónde tus padres. Yo, yo creo que, mira, where do you parent? Como que digamos que dónde tus padres. Ajá. Uh -huh. Es que. Es que para mí sería como que le preguntara si le gusta, porque la respuesta es como decir, supongo que a ellos les gusta. Ajá. No, mm -hmm. do your parents like the yours, the yours, the yours. So, ajá, what, what. Yo creo que es what do. Ajá, what, what ajá, yo creo que también es what. The yours. What, y yo creo que después parents like the yours. Luego um, dice, I don't remember. Um, Podría ser, where do they work? 
Ajá. Sí, así sería que oigo. Where do they work? Porque le dice in a office in the city. Um, en una oficina en la ciudad, entiendo yo. Uh -huh. Así que Um, number four sería um, oh, word, but word what do you do? Okay. Eh, voy a iniciar. What does your sister do? My sister. She is a nurse. How does she like it? It's difficult, but she loves it. Uh, what does your brother do? At the airport. He is a pilot. Oh, how does he like it? He doesn't really like it. Okay. How do your parents how do your parents like the jobs See, oh. Like, oh i guess they like them i don't remember uh, where do they work in an office in the city what do you do i am a, I am a student i see How do you like your classes? They're good. I like them a lot. Okay. Creo que sí las hemos escrito bien. <laughs> bueno, yo ya. <laughs> Así las tenés. Are you ready, Karen? Yes, Karen. Okay. Karen and Jessica. Ah, yo y, yo y Karen. Yes. Okay. No sé si está lista, Karen. Sí. Okay. What does your brother do? Yes. <laughs> My sister. Porque llevaríamos do otra vez al final. Do they? Sí. Uh -huh. What do they do? In an office in the city. En la en oficina en la ciudad. Mm -hmm. En la Entonces, cuatro. Amastari. La cuatro sería también va. What do they what do you do? Amastari. Finish. Yes. Finish. Great. Yes. yes. Awesome. Mm -hmm. One second. Okay. Complete the conversations, then practice with a partner. What does your sister do? My sister, she's a nurse. The next question. How? How does she like how? it? How does she like it? Does she like it? Like. 
Mm -hmm. How does she like it? It's difficult, but she loves it. Right. Number two. Where? 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 Does your brother? At the airport. Work. 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 Where work. does your brother work? At the airport. He's a pilot. Oh. How? How does he? How does like he like it? Work. Like. Like. Yes. How does he like it? Cuando unimos el like en el it, se pronuncia como si fuera una sola palabra, ¿verdad? How does he like it? Like it. He doesn't really like it. Oh my God, and he's a pilot. Y no le gusta. Imagine. <laughs> Careful. Pobre. Pobre Poor passengers, <laughs> yes. <laughs> Imagine. ¿Cómo se dice miedo? Eh, eh, eh. Fear. Fear. Uh -huh. Imagine. Se siente miedito. <laughs> yeah, kind of fear factor there. All right. <laughs> Number three. What do your parents? What do your parents? Their job like? Mm. No, is how do you how do your parents like their job? How do your parents how, like? How exactly do your parents like their job? Like their jobs? Yes. How do your parents like their jobs? Oh, I guess they like them. I don't remember. Where? Where? Where, mm -hmm. Where do they? Where do they work? Work. work. Where do they work? Uh -huh. In an office in the city. Uh -huh. what, what, what does you what? do? What do you do? What, what, do, you what do? do you do? Sounds, do you do? sounds kind of different, kind of weird, but it's this is the correct form of asking. This is the correct way. What do you do? I'm a student. I see. How? Mm -hmm. How like, do you like, do you like, like your class. classes? How do you like your classes? They're good. I like them a lot. Okay. So this is how we ask and answer these questions, right? So let me move this bars up. Okay, now we have these pictures. Ya habíamos hecho las questions sobre Ben, las questions sobre Claudia y las de Vicky y Owen nos hacen falta, ¿verdad? Bye. Las de Ben era What does he do? Or where does he work? How does he like it? Right? So, vamos a hacerlos en el mismo orden en el que las tenemos aquí arriba y la primera es Yes? Where does Ben work? Mhm. Uh -huh. Where does Ben work? He works in? He works in a restaurant. In a restaurant. A restaurant. A restaurant. Yes. What does he do? He uh, is, is a waiter. waiter. He is a waiter. How does he like he, it? I don't like he, it. He hates doesn't it. He doesn't like, like it. He doesn't really like it. He hates it. Or it's very tiring, it's very stressful, it's very difficult, it's complicated. Uh huh. Next picture Where does Claudia work? In a hospital. In a hospital. In a hospital. Yeah. What does she do? He's a nurse. Uh, a doctor. He's a doctor, probably. And how does she like it? She. It's okay. She, she, like, like, okay. she really likes it. It's okay. It's great. It's good. It's fine. She loves it. Yes. Now, vamos okay. a hablar de ellos, de ambos, okay? Yes. Where do they work? They Digamos work. que es una shop mm. o una store, ¿verdad? They work in a store. In a store. Or in a store. In a, they store. Work in a store. What do they do? They're they are They are salespersons. Sales persons. Persons. They are cashiers. Yes. Uh huh. And how do they like it? Um, they. 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 Are, no, they. Hate it. 
they like hate caring. it. They don't they really hate. like it. They think it's difficult, tiring, stressful, boring. Yes? So that would be the way of asking and answering. Okay? Vamos a borrar acá por cuestiones de... All right. Okay, next conversation. That's exciting. Remember, we are expressing opinion about jobs. Hey, Stephanie, I hear you have a new job. Yes, I'm teaching math at Lincoln High School. How do you like it? It's great. The students are terrific. How are things with you? Not bad. I'm a firefighter now, you know. That's exciting. Yes, but it's a very stressful job. And sometimes it's dangerous. Y aquí ya tenemos como cuatro formas de describir los trabajos, ¿verdad? Stressful, dangerous, exciting, uh -huh, it's great, ¿ya? Ya yes, mm -hmm. yes, vimos varias formas, varios adjetivos. Obviamente va a depender de las condiciones de trabajo, ¿verdad? Y de qué tanto nos guste. Mm -hmm. Para decir algo positive o algo no tan positive. All right, one more time. Hey, Stephanie, I hear you have a new job. Yes, I'm teaching math at Lincoln High School. How do you like it? It's great. The students are terrific. How are things with you? Not bad. I'm a firefighter now, you know. That's exciting. Yes, but it's a very stressful job. And sometimes it's dangerous. Okay. Hay alguna question sobre esta, esta uh, conversation? Sobre el vocabulary. Algo que quieran. Si podría mencionar de nuevo cómo se pronuncia fire. Ah, firefighter. Fire, fire, traten como de separarlo en dos palabras, porque son dos. Fire, de fuego. Fire, fighter. On fire. 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 Si sí, ha escuchado la expresión, I'm on fire. He's on fire. Estoy prendido. <risa> <laughs> on fire fire fighter fighter es como alguien que combate el fuego <laughs> yes fire fighter fighter yes any other in, in uh, the student are ter terrified terrific terrific yes actually esta like palabra a sí esta palabra es positive, pero si decimos terrible, es negative. <laughs> terrific is they are good. The students are terrific. Pero si dijéramos, the students are terrible, that is negative. So the students are terrific. It's great. I love it. It's good. Yes? Any other? ¿Alguna otra? Yeah. Sí, teacher. Stressful, no. Stressful, stressful. Es bien okay. estresante. It's a very stressful job. Es muy estresante. Uh -huh. And sometimes it's dangerous. Yes? Bye. Vamos a practicar esta conversación tal cual está, pero... Después de una o dos veces de practicarla así como está, ustedes tienen que usar su imagination. Y ya no van a decir, hey, Stephanie, no, sino que ya sus real names, ¿verdad? Hey, Fátima, I hear you have a new job. Así como que, hey, Fátima, escucha que tienes un nuevo trabajo. Y se va a responder, yes, I'm, y va a decir qué es lo que está haciendo. I'm working for this and this company. Yes, sorry, que se me molesta la presentación. Yes, y va a sustituir esto de que I'm teaching math at Lincoln High School por un trabajo real o por lo menos un trabajo más cercano o un trabajo que usted le gustaría tener si es que todavía no tiene un trabajo. Yes, how do you like it? Y pues ahí puede responder. It's awesome, it's good, it's okay. Y dar la razón por la que piensan que el trabajo es de esa forma. Y luego regresa la misma pregunta. How are things with, with you? ¿Y cómo van las cosas contigo? Not bad. Y decir otro trabajo, obviamente, no diga firefighter. Invente cualquier otro si en realidad no tiene un trabajo. Y, y le, luego igual le dicen, that's exciting. Yes, but it's a very stressful job. Yes, but it's a very complicated job. Yes, but it's a very tiring job. 
and sometimes it's really boring o algo, algo más que ustedes puedan cambiar por las opciones que ya les da la conversation. Clear? Yes. Vamos a yes. role play the conversation. Vamos a trabajar en los mismos grupos. Don't worry. ¿Quién va a comenzar? Mm. Um, okay. Vaya. Solo que está cargando la pantalla. No le carga. Creo que se quedó congelada la compañera. Pero bueno, ahorita sí. se quede, puede escuchar o ver um, hasta ahorita. Oh, okay. Pero está como que está cargando. Ya la puede ver. No. No. ¿Y si dejo de compartir y la vuelvo a compartir? Um, si quiere. Ah, ok. Ahora sí. Ok. Ok. Usted es Richard y yo Stephanie. Ok. Hey Stephanie, here you have a new job. Yes, I'm teaching my in Lincoln High School. How do you like? How do you like it? It's great. The students are um, terrific. Um, how how are they with you? Not bad. I'm five fighter. Now you know. Thanks. Exciting. Yes, but it's a very stressful job, and some work que dice. Ajá, en cambio, nos... Ajá, digamos, es diferente hablar como parte por parte y lo hablando así, digamos. Eh, how do you like it? Por ejemplo, esa, how do you like it? it? Entonces, cuando uno lo habla fluido, how, how do you like it? it? Perdón. Y después, it's great. The students are terrific. <ríe> y, ajá. y así, ajá, ajá, es como hablarlo. Yo creo que es de que aprendas a conectar las partes. Ok, ahí um, sí. Si quieren, practicamos ya. Bueno, comienzo. ¿Sería con, con el compañero? Sí. Um, James, I take technique, no sé cómo se dice esta palabra. Um, met a Lincoln High School. Uh, teaching, I guess. I'm teaching. Oh? Uh, no, la palabra. I'm teaching. 
teacher. Ah, uh, okay. Uh, how do you like it? It's great. The students are ter terrific. Terrific, right? Es que me cuesta pronunciarlo. No, tranquilo. Creo que es lo que Oh, sí. Uh, how, are, how are these with you? Uh, bye bye. I'm fire, fire. Now you know. That's exiting. Mira. Ahorita voy a. ¿Qué se diría? Ah, aquí está la teacher. Le podemos preguntar. Teacher. Este, ¿Cómo se, se diría facilitadora en, en un taller de uh, coach? Coach. Uh -huh. Vaya. Ahora, Entonces, trainer. Sería... Gracias. Trainer. Uh -huh. Entonces sería. I'm a coach. Eh, I'm a trainer. Ah, uh, yes, I'm a trainer. In a... Ahí puede decir el lugar donde trabaja. Uh -huh. In a, in a dignas. Yes. In a association. In association, la dignas. Uh -huh. Uh -huh. Okay. How do you like it? Yes, it's great and interesting. And interesting. 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 Yes. How are things with you? Okay. ¿Sí? ¿Qué cómo van las cosas contigo? Uh -huh. Uh -huh. Ajá, y le puedo responder. Eh, no tiene que ser necesariamente lo, lo malo, ¿verdad? No, great. Uh -huh. Excellent. Uh, very well. It's, very good. It's, good. it's uh -huh. very good. I am uh, analyst. You know. It's a. Um, um, Exciting and interesting. That's interesting and exciting. That's interesting. That's that is interesting. Okay. Yes. It's um, interesting and... ¿Cómo se diría? Como... Difficult, demanding. Yeah, sí. Yes, it's an interesting and difficult job. And sometimes it's uh, stressful. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> Good. Vaya, ahora, ¿Qué no seríamos? Vuelvan eh, a hacer, o vuelvan a hacer, tal, tal vez ya no le sale tan así como tan forzado, sino el más fluido. La mm. misma conversación. Exactly. Ya con su realidad. Vaya. Uh -huh. eh, ¿Quién era yo primero, verdad? Sí. Hey, Rox. Okay. Hey, Roxana. I hear you have a new job. That's so tiring. Yes, but but it, come on. Yes, but a, a very stressful job, and sometimes it it uh -huh, it sounds hero. No, ni peligroso es como. Es decir, easy, easy. No, es algo. It's it's a difficult. It's, it's a difficult. more or less difficult. Mm -hmm. Or stressful. Uh -huh. It's a, it's okay. Listo. Podemos right. tratar de, de, uh -huh. de traducirlo ahora. Okay, cambiamos, cambiamos solo la profesión, pero no cambiamos las, las dificultades, las este. Sí, las, algunos sí. Ajá, algunos sí, pero la otra era, por ejemplo, eh, is great. O sea, es, es bueno, es. Eh, Genial. Ajá. No nos pasamos de ahí. Right. Mm -hmm. okay. Nos gusta el trabajo por eso. Aquí está la lista. Positivo. Positivo. O, no alguien, terrible. o alguien lo tiene. Porque ah. según yo era como terrible. No, dijo, la, dijo, 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 que que era dijo que era positivo. Ajá, era ah. El otro era, eh, ¿cómo fue que dijo? Eh, terrible. 
terrible, good. thanks. Yes, right? terrific is good, terrific. Terrific yes. is como grandioso, maravilloso. Ah, oh, And terrible oh. si es bad. Qué engañosa esa palabra. Yes, por eso les hice la diferencia, porque ambas suenan parecidas a español, como terrible. Pero ah. one is positive and the other is negative. Terrific is good. Terrible is not good. Terrible. Okay. Yes. Thanks, teacher. You're welcome. Uh, teacher, uh, yes. Exciting. 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 Oh, okay. Exciting. Exciting. Yes. Emocionante. But it's es, es stressful. Es? Stressful. Stressful. ¿Cómo viene de estrés? Como en español. Stressful. It's a stressful, stressful. job. Stressful job. Mm -hmm. ¿Y cómo se dice? Yes. But it's. Para unir ese del bat is a very, ¿cómo era? But it's a very, but it's a very stressful job. <laughs> very, but, it, but it's, but it's a very stressful job. But, but it's, but it's, but it's, but it's a very stressful job. But it's a very stressful job. Yeah. No traten de hacer tantas pausas, pero no quede un sol. But it's a very stressful job. Exactly. But it's a very stressful job. Okay. Mm -hmm. um, ¿Qué más? <laughs> ya practicamos. <laughs> Seguimos practicando. Seguimos practicando. Okay. Ahora inicia tú, si querés. Ah, no, voy a iniciar yo. Okay. Hi, Stephanie. I hear you have a new girl. No, pero hagámoslo con tus datos. Ah, okay, okay. Hey, David. I hear you have a new job. Yes, I have a new job. I am a quality engineer, but I am a student too. How do you like it? It's great, but it's very tired. How are, how are things with you? Not bad. I'm a student uh, of business administration in the university. You know. That's interesting. Yes, but it's uh, very stressful. Okay. Ahora con Karen, puedes practicar. Hi. Hello. <laughs> How was the practice? How did you like it? Muy buena practice. It was good. <laughs> it was kind of difficult. I know. It's kind of challenging. It's kind of hard. But that's the idea, okay? No worries. Okay, great. I hear you have very interesting jobs now. Okay, here we have some images. Uh huh. Number one, what does he do? Actor. Actor. Long answer. He's a... He is an actor. actor. Number actor. two, what does she do? She's, She's an actor. actress. She's an actress. A, mm -hmm. cuando la palabra inicia con consonant, and cuando la palabra inicia con vowel, right? So number one, he's an actor. Number two, she's an actress. An actor. Number three, what does he do? Baker. Yeah. He's a baker. He's a baker. He's a baker. Number four, what does he do? He's, he's a, a chef. chef. He's, he's a, a chef. chef. Uh -huh. Number five, what does she do? She's, she's a, a construction worker. worker. She's a construction worker. Number six, what does she do? She's a dancer. 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 Number seven, what does he do? She's a mechanic. He's a mechanic. He's a mechanic. He's a mechanic. Aunque se escriba uh -huh. CH, se pronuncia como una C, como mechanic, mm. nada más, right? Number eight, what does she do? She's a salesperson. Number nine, what does he do? 
Mr. Sai. He is a secretary. He is a secretary. Uh huh. Number ten. What does she do? He's a singer. He's a singer. Okay. Number eleven. What does he do? He's a superintendent. He's a superintendent. That's it. Un superintendente es como alguien que está a cargo de la llave, del mantenimiento, puede ser de una oficina, de una empresa o de un edificio de apartamentos, como en este caso. All right. That's, that's the meaning of superintendent. Number 12, what does she do? She's a teacher. She's a teacher. She's a teacher. And number 13, what does he do? He's a driver. He's a driver. He's a truck driver. All right. Questions? Van a escribir por lo menos tres cosas que aprendieron este día en el chat. <laughs> ok. A ver, al menos tres cosas que este día aprendimos en el chat. Tres oraciones pueden ser, no problem. Three sentences. Uh -huh. Yes, in English, de preferencia. It's okay, que lo puedan expresar en Spanish, but I prefer English. <laughs> okay, terrific. Okay. To practice English, no tiene que ser gran paragraph, ¿verdad? Pero expressions, okay. Expresiones sencillas, si por algo se empieza. Describe jobs, terrific, firefighter. Uh -huh, that's great. Exactly. Uh -huh. Learn about jobs, being able to pronounce new words. Uh -huh. Practice with partners. That's another idea. Definitely. Okay. Being able to pronounce new words. Good. Bueno, vamos a double check la attendance por aquellos que se lograron incorporar después. Uh -huh. Alguien que no le hayamos tomado attendance. Yo, yo. Díganme los names, please. Y el number, si es posible. <ríe> y así no perdemos más el number time. Five. Number 5. Number 5, Damaris. What happened? No, la señaló mucho, me funcionaba, pero aquí está. Ah, the microphone. Ok. Next. El número 17. 17. Karen, ah, yes, que acababa de terminar de, de pasar la tenis cuando te vi que habías ingresado. Ah, uh, bueno. <laughs> True. Ajá, uh -huh. somebody else? No more? No more people in the class? No more, no more? Ok, perfect. Ajá, uh -huh. veamos qué más dijeron en el chat. Make answers of jobs in new vocabulary, the simple present with WH questions. Exactly. Where, how what mm -hmm. that's good ¿Cómo van con la platform ¿Qué, les, qué, qué tal les está yendo con la platform fine fine great terrific good <laughs> awesome incredible <laughs> wonderful <laughs> no problem no problem <laughs> there is an exam Combatiendo el fuego. Content, content, on fire. Content, firefighter, contenido. Fighting against English now. ¿Quién, no, ¿quién, es la que va, ¿Quién es la que va combatiendo el fuego? On fire. Pero si te, tuvieron examen. Con, oh, no, no, no yet. Combatiendo no el contenido. Ajá. Ajá. Fighting against the content. Como examen medio, creo que era. Ajá, él. va a haber un midterm, sí. ¿verdad? Es. Semana creo que es. Sí, el de, este, el de esta semana. Sí, revisen ahí las fechas, la, la calendarización y todo, ¿ok? okay. Well, congratulations. Ya vamos liberando aquí la presión de, del estrés de no hablar. <risa> Entrando en confidence, en power, ¿ok? Nothing happens, don't worry. Nadie, okay. nadie ha nacido aprendido en la vida. We all learned, ¿ok? 
don't okay. worry too much okay have a good night enjoy see you tomorrow or oh, tomorrow is the class number four in this week it's the second week right oh my god okay. time flies yes. do yeah. it now or <laughs> you'll regret it okay enjoy okay. god bless good night good night, good night. Good night. Good night. see you